Hey you guys, so before I get into your reading, I just want to take a minute to tell you about Ella Sparks, the accessory mall. The accessory mall has thousands of pieces to choose from. They have everything from zodiac jewelry, bridal jewelry, even men's pieces. If you guys like what I have on, I will link everything below. Everything came from illasparks.com. Ella Sparks has been all about expressing your individual style and personality. There's thousands of pieces to choose from. Shipping is always free. You can pick through a versatile assortment of pieces that are funky, chic, unique. Everything is nickel and lead free. Their pieces are made from the best quality materials. Their pieces are affordable and shipping is always free. So that's illasparks.com, you guys. Everything will be linked below. And with that, let's get into your reading. Hey Pisces, Happy New Year. Thank you guys so much for being here with me. My name is Lynn and this is Pastor Heart Tarot. If you are new to my channel, welcome. Thank you so much. And if you are one of my returning subscribers, thank you. And thank you for sending through my promotion for Ella Sparks, you guys. So this is going to be your love reading for the week ahead. And this energy is from the 4th today through the 11th. Just know, Pisces, that I send you all so much love and light. And if you would like to book a personal reading with me or follow me on Instagram, everything will be linked below. And before I get into your reading, I just want to take a moment to invite the white light and the Holy Spirit, Pisces. And then we'll see what energy do we have coming in for the week ahead. So first off, what it's, it's funny because I just hear so many different things, getting so many different messages already. You have someone who has their eye on you, or you could be watching someone, Pisces, but I mean, someone feels like this person is out of their league. They do. It could be how someone is feeling about you that has their eye on you because I can see a person that's in this energy where they just have everything going for themselves. They, and you know what, frankly, this person may already be involved with someone. They may already be in a committed relationship, be someone's partner, be someone's parent. Be, although this energy is feminine, it, it is the energy of someone who is already taken and who is who is already a very important part of someone else's life because this person they're they're taken so the energy of feeling like this person's out of their league. It could be because you Pisces may already be in a relationship with someone, may already have a family. You have an admirer that is around you and the connection, it's, you may be feeling attracted to this person. You may even be feeling guilty about feeling attracted to them because I can see where this energy is coming in for the potential of having something very steamy. It is something that is with someone who kind of blows you away because there's just such a physical attraction. And I mean, it's like connecting sexually and the potential is for it to be very, very good. But just know that this person is not offering any, st they're not offering stability they're not offering emotion. It's kind of like a very, very lustful energy that you have around you. And I know that you guys may may feel, someone may feel guilty about thinking of this person, about fantasizing, about daydreaming about them, because I, I can see someone here who tries very hard not to see, you know, in their mind, picture it. Um, fantasize and even look at look at them and they're in an energy where they're trying to be very defensive you know like this is like don't don't come near me don't touch me but deep down there is an attraction that is there so i wonder because i can see this energy i can feel this energy of someone who's who's gonna swallow their pride but 
be careful not to make any mistakes. This is this is this is this is kind of dangerous here because there's potential for someone to just kind of let their feelings get away with them and just being kind of self-centered impulsive so just know that if these are not your feelings pisces you you have someone here that's watching you that is lusting after you because i mean they're they're seeing you the way someone very important may see you you know they're seeing you in a way that is like they're in awe of you this is why they may feel like you're out of their league because it is someone who just has everything going for themselves career wise financially the way that they dress the way that they carry themselves it is making this person lust after you and watch you i want to see i wonder if you're open to this like you may you may be open to it, but what I can see here, and not to make any judgments, I mean, I'm not here to judge, but someone is already taken. Someone is, someone does already have a family. And, and just know, if you're wondering, that's the thing. Because with these temptations that are around someone, Pisces, could be around you, could be around your person. With these temptations, this person may be wondering if if the if their partner that already has them, this is for someone who's already in a relationship and knows that they're being tempted by someone. This person that's already in the relationship may be wondering, well, how does my person see me? Do they still think I'm hot? Do they still think this? You know, are they still attracted to me as they once were? They absolutely are because they view you as someone who is like their partner. They're not going to make any decisions without you. Just know that they hold you in such high regard, like they have you up on a pedestal. You're so important to them. So I know that it can be tempting to have someone who's just complimenting all the time, who makes you feel attractive, that makes you feel sexy, that makes you feel wanted, that's always watching you, commenting, you know, it can feel good. But just know that the one that is around you now holds you in such high regard. So that's that's just super important for someone to know. Let's look at this Knight of Wands. With this Leo energy that's here, it's just spirit letting me know about the temptation. And, and you don't wanna get caught up in this karmic cycle because that's what's happening. You, there's someone who's being pulled in a certain direction and it's going against what they know is right, so to speak, because there's potential for someone to stray. And what I can see here is like, this is a test. It's a test that you charted for yourself because there's so much past life energy that's here and there's a balancing of karmic lessons. So it's up to someone to decide if they want to fail or pass the test. But I mean, that's what it is, is you are being tested by your higher self with these temptations that are around you. That's what I can see, it, it, it is a test. So I wonder if you'll give into it, especially if, if someone gets in their head and feels like their person is taking them for granted, if they feel like this is something that's very exciting, just know that it's like karma, that's essentially what it is. It is karma. I want to see why is this Empress here? It's karma. And I know some of you know what the right thing to do is. And that is to uh, suppress, suppress this connection, suppress these feelings. 
to not give in to this person sexually because it'll be more than sexually because a lot of emotion will be there not offered by the person who wants to not this person is just very lustful but i can see here where if someone gives in to this lustful person they may think it's going to amount to something more and it's it's not it's not amounting to anything more. It's like a, a karmic lesson that's here. So I can see some Libra energy. So you guys could be dealing with a Libra or you could have Libra in your chart. But now is not the time to think with your emotions. I mean, I feel like this is just one big warning to someone to not make a mistake. But I mean, obviously you'll do what you feel is right but it isn't what spirit is telling me to tell you as that it is important for for you to think very logically here and not think um with how you feel well did you guys hear that i think my neighbor dropped a glass or something just as okay so take that as a sign because that's just really random let's see why is this five of swords here That's, I'm telling you, that's what it is. Like I can see, it's like a warning because it can lead to someone breaking up, breaking up, especially for those, someone knows they're already in a connection. They know they're being tempted. It can lead to you guys, to things really falling apart. If you let someone come between you and your person with this, this energy of threes, which is like an interference, which is something coming between you guys. If you let that happen, you may not realize it, but you're turning your back on a twin flame connection that you're already involved in. So don't let your pride get the best of you. Don't let your ego get the best of you. Because if someone does, if they're gassed up so much that they let their ego, you know, oh, this person's showing me so much attention, it makes me feel good, blah, blah, blah. What you're gonna do is mess up your whole connection. That's what I can see. Because who you're dealing with, the person who's serious about you is your twin flame. You may not realize that though. And you open the door for so much sadness to come in. Sadness that you will uh, inevitably bring to the person who does care about you so much. So I know that this reading was very specific, but there are there's a lot of temptation that's around right now. So it could even be something that your person is dealing with. But Part of it does stem from this person's ego. And then another part of it stems from this person's need to feel like they are special. So if Pisces, you feel like you've been neglecting your person and you know that you could put in more effort and do better, that's not to say that this person is at all justified if they go ahead and stray with this temptation that's around them that's not what i'm saying but i mean if you feel like you can put in more effort to make your person feel special now is certainly the time to do that all right pisces so just know that i send you all so much love and light and i feel like i mean it is a beautiful message because you'll know what to do especially if you feel like you have been neglecting someone that you feel like you could be doing more it is it is the time to do more and for those of you that are being tempted in this way just know that what i can see is you may not realize that you are already with a person who is very special you don't always get these twin flame connections so someone needs to really think very logically and not let their ego or like their sex drive get the best of them and cause them to ruin something that is very beautiful that they have. Okay, Pisces, so just know that I love you guys and I thank you for being here with me. And if you haven't already subscribed, please do. And I will talk to you guys next week. Happy New Year.